Hello guys and my name is Talan and today I will be giving you another Rempai tutorial. <coughs> Sorry guys, I've got a bit, of a, a bit of a cough. Right. So in this tutorial I will be teaching you how to add side images. Now if you have no idea what side image is, well then don't worry my friend because I have an example to show you. Basically, as you can see, this little image here is a side image. These side images are used for main characters in visual or kinetic novels so if you've got a main character in this in your project then it would be a good idea to use a side image because it makes the story more clear to know who is the main character okay so now let's get back to work so i created this little rampai game project to just show you what a side image is actually like Oops, sorry guys, this is definitely not it. Don't worry about that section, I think I completely removed it for some reason. Oh, okay. So, basically I opened up this new project called Test. After you have done that, click on script.rpy, which stands for Rampy. And JEdit will magically appear. Now, this is what JEdit obviously looks like, so I've done nothing to it. Basically, what you have to do, first of all, just completely ignore JEdit. Go back to Rampy Launcher and go on to the, your project and go on to Open Directory Game. Now, when you have done that, make sure that you've got characters in there. Basically, I have done this character called Sora for my site image. She's a main character. Now... One more important thing, when you name your image, don't just type in the name, for example, the, her name is Amelia. So you don't just type in Amelia, you have to add a side next to it. So if you decide, and then you write down Amelia. Because if you do not add the, um, sorry guys, if you do not add the word side before it, then... So if you do not I add the um, side to it, then it will not um, work on a side image. So just make sure that you've got side in front of it before you do anything. So let's close this. We don't need it anymore. Now go on to the script. And this will come up. You First of all, you do not declare your images under this section. You go on to uh, the section where it says define declare characters used by this game or define whatever and then you write down image um sora no hang on sorry guys what you do is side image <coughs> actually it is not i keep getting this next up it's image side and then type in the name of your character, so ours was called Sora. Actually, I might just as well go with Amelia for some reason. And then you do equals, and then you type in the name. Then you type in like the file name, which we called side. Was it Amelia or Sora? I, don't, I can't actually remember. One second, I'll just. Amelia. Dot PNG. That's all you got to do. But, however, let's edit this part. So, Amelia. So obviously, A stands for Amelia. I won't worry about the color right now. Okay. So this is a tricky part. Press comma, and then image equals. Amelia equals comma window left padding is 160. Sorry, no space is needed. And then comma. So this is it. And then we change these because it's A right now. He stands for image and let's say this is what your side image will look like D 
do not forget to resize your side image so it fits your whole text box. Unfortunately, I have not resized mine yet, as you can see. I hope that this tutorial was helpful. Oops. Please subscribe. Thank you. Okay, so now save it. We don't need this anymore. And this. And this launch project.